dribbling, dribbling with our feet. Now, I'm gonna read you a couple different things so that I do one video for kindergarten through fifth grade. Kindergartners, you only need to move the ball forward. It's slow and controlled. Now, obviously if we keep the roll up like this, you're going to use the inside of your foot and it's not gonna go away from you. You're gonna make sure you're in that big, open, safe space. Make sure your parents are okay if you need to move something out of the way. You do not have to go outside if you have a backyard. You can, it's slow and controlled. I know all my kindergartners like to look down the ball. I need you all to look up. But now, if I turn it this way, it could roll a funny way out of the way. Okay, try to do a few. Try to move around your room a little bit. Try to use the inside of your foot. Remember, if you put your feet together and it's where your feet touch each other, that is the inside. Okay, my first graders, you can actually use a little bit more force. So what that means is you can use a little bit more of a swinging action of the leg. We didn't do trapping and stopping it. Whoop. And being a little bit more quicker with the movement. Third, uh, second graders. Oh, okay. So second graders is really about your body and staying in control. So we're going to increase our speed. We're going to move forward. And we're going to really try and look up. I should really get my children in here to be demonstrating this instead of Mrs. Sargent, but. Okay, now, third, fourth, and fifth graders. Hang on. You are picking up your pace. So, if you have something that you want to start moving around, pretend like they're players. For my older students, you can. We're going to be doing that more in the next uh, couple of videos in the weeks to come. But you can actually pick up your pace a little bit. Okay? One foot, then the other. Now, you don't have to do it that way. Remember, I challenged my older students in that first video, you could use the outside of your foot. You could use the same foot. You don't have to change feet as you get older. And you're picking up your pace. Now I get it, some of you are in apartments, you're upstairs, you can't make a lot of noise. That's okay. Just use the walking motion and you're pushing and dribbling, dribbling with your feet. Inside for younger grades. My older grades can start using the outside. Have fun with it. I wanna see what you have. Have a great afternoon. Bye.